Yes, hello everybody. Hi. Thank you. Hello. Thank you for the welcome. Um, I guess uh, the best thing I can say that I want you all to know, one thing is important. We've been watching some independent films, and this is a wonderful thing for people to be able to get started. Well, this movie, although it's a cult classic, it's been around for a long time, it too was a independent movie. It was Jack Marquette who was a cameraman, and he wrote the script, and he wanted to produce this independent movie, and it was done with a small budget, and as far, I had actually did a television show in which he was the lead cameraman on the television show. It was called Man and the Challenge. And so he asked me if I was interested in doing a movie with him. I was astounded. I didn't even have to audition. He had seen my work on television and cast me in the role. And I didn't know at the time how big the role was. But, you know, it's funny, on the set, because they had a limited budget, they couldn't cover two close-ups, long shots, all that stuff. So they had the camera moving around. And you walked in and out of close-ups. You walked over here for a long shot. So it was all choreographed while the camera was moving. That was pretty inventive at that time. Now they have cameras on the shoulders. And they walk along with it. You've seen television shows and how fast they move and everything. And, and, and with the camera, the cameras were very flexible. Before, they were on the rails. So you had to be very specific where you moved. And so he would have choreographed it like a five-page scene. And so he came to me as a new actress in film because I hadn't done much work. He said, are you sure you'll be able to remember the lines and all of that? I said, oh yes, I won't have any problem. And by myself, I was thinking, why is he worried that I would remember five pages when I just got through doing Juliet for Romeo and Juliet? So the Shakespeare, you know, the Shakespeare. But what was difficult was hitting your marks. That's really what he was talking about. And that's what took you know, us to rehearse several times over and over again. We're making sure we get hit our marks when we were supposed to. And that was very new to me. Um, that, I think that's about all. Watch the film. And uh, when you want to ask questions, I guess they're going to have that later on. So have fun. And remember, the, word, the special effects were very inventive at the time. This is before computers, okay? So if you remember that. <laughs> Everybody, Joyce Meadows. Thank you, Joyce. Thank you very much. All right, and you can see Joyce Meadows and I are going to be up here later. It's going to be kind of like the Joel Wankoop show live. I mean, she's going to be my guest. So we're going to be up here on stage after the brain from Planet Eros. And we are going to start that right now. Wayne, why don't we do anything out there? <laughs> Every shoot I'm on, people, the, the directors all go, they go, Mike, everybody except for wine coop. You don't have a mic camera. So, wait, go ahead and roll the frame from Planet Arrows. Thank you.